Hello everyone, Blizzard has finally decided to reintroduce the 50% experience buff. This buff you can enable at any innkeeper. So today I'll be talking about different ways that you can level up even faster to reach level 80 as fast as possible and hopefully also be prepared before the next phase. In this case when I make this video, phase 3. So the first thing is of course to go to Dalaran and if you have any leftover emblems, I would highly recommend you to spend these on heirloom items. The two most important heirloom items to purchase is the shoulders and the chest, as these increase your experience gained by 10% for each item you equip. These items will upgrade themselves as you level up your character. So at level 1, you can use this item. When you reach level 2, it becomes even better. And remember, you can send these to all characters and even the opposite faction. And what I also like to do is to enchant these items to make them even better, so you can level even faster. For those of you with a lot of gold, and if you just boosted a character to level 70, then there's an easy way to reach level 80. You can go to the auction house and purchase this item. This item will start a quest, and it's a repeatable quest. You just purchase a new item every time you would like to hand it in. This grants a decent amount of experience, and this was even captured when there was no 50% experience buff. But yeah, this is also going to be an expensive way to level up your character. Instead, I have some other tips for those of you that don't have a lot of gold. So if you just reach level 60 or level 70, then make sure to go to Okrima as Horde or Stormwind City as Alliance. In these cities, you can find a vendor where you can purchase level 60 and 70 PvP items. And this is weapons, but also armor sets. These will definitely be increasing your leveling speed, but it also requires a bit of honor. So make sure to do a battleground once in a while. What I also like to do with the level 70 items is to gem these with Wrath of the Lich King gems and maybe even enchant them to level even more efficiently. To level as efficient as possible, I also like to use the add-on Rested Experience. This is a leveling add-on that will tell you where you need to go, so what quests you need to pick up, where you need to do them and hand them in, and in what order. It will even tell you when you need to change your hearthstone, use your hearthstone, purchase new items, and a lot of other things. For example, when you need to go learn a certain spell. This add-on is developed by the best speed levelers in World of Warcraft and is updated frequently. If you wish to test this add-on yourself, then make sure to check out the description where you can find a link to the Rested Experience add-on. For those of you who already have a level 80 character, Make sure to go to Dalaran. Here you can purchase the Tome of Cold Weather Flying, an item you can send to an old character so you can start flying in Northrend at level 68. Without this item, you will need to be level 77 to fly in Northrend. If you are watching this video just as they are about to enable the 50% experience, then you could always try to prepare a few quests. So the moment they enable the buff, you can hand in these quests for even more experience. And if the weekly battleground is Elsvik Valley, then remember to also do this battleground. You'll gain so much experience, and it's probably one of the fastest ways to level to 80. Between level 51 and all the way up to 70, you usually get around 15% experience for each battleground. And between 70 to 80, it's going to be around 8 to 9%. For more WoW Classic content, for example the upcoming Phase 3, make sure to check out the channel. As always, thank you so much for watching, and have an amazing day. Peace!